Hey everybody, we back with another box. Mm -hmm. And today we have a Because of Them We Can box. Mm -hmm. Yep, so we're gonna open it up and see what's inside, okay? okay? Okay, so in this box, it's called a Because We Can box. It's just for kids. And this is more centered on black history. So this teaches you fun facts about our ancestors. Our ancestors are people that lived before us. Okay, do y'all know? Yeah, y'all know any important black ancestors? Martin Luther King. Who else? Mr. Obama. He's an important black person. Who, who else, who you got, Carmel? What president? Mr. Obama. Obama. Yes, we're talking about black they people. Kids. Their kids, Sasha and Malia. So this this box is gonna be teaching us something, a fun fact about somebody that's black and that's important. So you know we learn about science, we also have to learn about history because that's important. All right? So let's open the box and see what they have this month. Okay. So you get a subscription and you get a box each month that'll have something different inside. Oops. That'll have something different inside, a different person. Go ahead, open it up. All right, hold up, let's check it out. So it says, it's time to go on an adventurous journey through history, time and space. Be prepared to go where no kid has gone before as you transform into heroes of our present and past. Buckle up. It's going to be a fun ride. Use the tools inside this box to help you connect the dots along the way. All right? So let's open up. Let's see. So it says, welcome to your first box. They're going to give you a letter from Bernice King. Do you know who Bernice King is? Think about it. Her last name is King. You just said her daddy's name. Martin Luther? Yep, Martin Luther King. All right, so she sent the letter, and they are going to give you a lanyard and a medal because you're becoming a young leader. That's fun, huh? Mm. So look, we're going to have to frame this letter, and we're going to read it later. It says her parents are Dr. Martin Luther King and Coretta Scott King. That's Martin Luther King's wife. So okay. that's pretty cool. DJ ball. Oh? A DJ ball. That's not no DJ. What is a DJ ball? I don't know. But anyway. All right. So, because of Tommy Smith and John Carlos. So, what that means is we have to find out who Tommy Smith and John Carlos is. So, remember I told you we're going to learn about people that we never knew about. So, let's okay. find out. Well, you got to find out why we have a flag. So, this is Tommy Smith, and this is John Carlos. How can you ask someone to live in the world and not have something to say about injustice? Because of them, we can. So, these are some cool stickers. From the picture, can you tell what they are? Well, they have a, a medal around their necks. What do you, how do you get a medal? You win. You win in something, so that means they must compete. They compete in something, that's how they got the medal, all right? Maybe they must have won something. Of course they did. All right, so this month's newsletter is about black change makers in the Olympics. So that's what they do, they are in the Olympics. So you know what the Olympics is, right? The best people in every sport go to the Olympics. So if you're really, really good, like Exactly. What was her name? Simone Biles, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so she was super good. And she messed with Mr. Obama. She sure did because she won the Olympics, all right? So we are going to learn about Tommy Smith and John Carlos, okay? So they tell us to brainstorm about colors, use visual aids, okay? So we're going to go on YouTube and find out about these two people so we can learn about them, but we're also going to learn here too. All right, so here's the the picture of them. 
and they have fist up. All right, so we're gonna go through this. We're gonna read, be active. Oh goodness, they give us some things to do to work out so we could be active. You wanna be what? President. The president? You gonna be the first woman president if you be the president. I've never had a woman president. All right. So we get some markers mm -hmm. because we're gonna have to design our own flag. Whoa. Wow. We and also we get a shirt because of them. What does it say? Because of them champion and training. Uh -huh. You got the fists, just like they do. And we have the metal, all right? So what we're gonna do first is we're gonna go learn about them. We're gonna go watch some videos and learn about Tommy Smith and John Carlos, okay? And after we learn about them, we're going to design our flags and we're gonna take our picture. So how do they do on a picture? How do they do their fists? Yeah, real live metal. All right, so let's learn first, okay? okay. So then y'all can come back and tell me something because I want y'all to tell me something about these two guys. We know they're in the Olympics, but we have to know a little bit more about them, okay? Okay, so we went and we learned, we watched some videos and we learned about Tommy Smith and John Carlos. What did we learn? After they won, they did, yeah, but one of them did the right hand and one of them did the left hand. So they say that they were putting their hands up. Why? Because they, they was like, they won. They won, but why did they put their hands up? They put their hands up because who, who, um, somebody wasn't being treated fairly. Who wasn't being treated fairly? Black, black. So black people weren't being treated fairly. Like so black people? Mm-hmm. I'm black and I didn't say that. Right, but this happened in 1968, so you weren't born yet. But at the time, black people were being treated unfairly. Okay? Not us either. Right, no, not y'all. But they were being treated unfairly. So John Carlos and Tommy Smith said that they want to attract attention to what's going on. So the way they did that was by doing what? Fist. Putting their fists up, all right? And what happened when they put their fists up? They fired them. They, they fired them. them. Yep, they got in trouble. So do y'all think they were wrong for putting their fists up? No. Mm -mm. Why they wasn't wrong? It's because they was doing that because black people don't respect them. Okay, so what we're gonna do now that we have this, so now we know a little bit more about them, right? Because mm -hmm. all they wanted was respect. So now what we're gonna do is do we're gonna flag. we're gonna make our flag. So we need to think about what we want on our flag. We're gonna make our flag red, and we're gonna put it on here. Red, white, blue. Red, white, and blue. That's the America flag. Yep. I need the medal. And who gets the pin? Carmel, you want the pin? All right, because remember they had their pin on too. So we're going to wear our pin. Too? Oh yeah, you get a big old medal. You get to be Tommy Smith. Tommy Smith was number one and John Carlos was number three. He got the bronze medal, all right? So let's work so on. Me? Yeah. Tommy Brown? No, you, John Carlos, oh, JC, Tommy, Tommy Smith. I tell. All right, so let's make our flag. All right, so right now we are about to work on our flags. So JJ says she wants to do the children's flag of America. Mm -hmm. So why did they hold their fists up again? Because they wanted respect. They wanted respect. That's all they wanted. That's all we want is respect, right? No, all they want is respect because they didn't respect them. That's correct. They didn't respect them. They so said. They put their hands up. Yep. They said that they were treated wrong. good when they were playing sports, but then when they left sports, they were treated wrong again. Yeah, you never know, okay? So remember, they got that's what they're doing in football right now. What they doing in football? They, they doing. What they doing in football? This, and people keep, like, saying, you should go. Right. Right. 
that they, they taking a knee and they taking a knee because the same thing they want respect so that's all we want is respect so what, sh what should we put our maybe we should put respect on our flag mm -hmm. that's a good like, idea just, like, draw a color and say, uh, all right so i'm gonna put black. respect on right so i'm gonna put respect on the flag and then we all can color how about that okay. yeah perfect Okay, so y'all finished y'all flag. What does y'all flag say? Respect. R-E-S-P-E-C-T. -E -E All right, so now y'all got to get y'all medals. Perry, do the honors. All right. Now what y'all do? They see y'all next time.